The following is an exclusive presentation of the NCCU Sports Network. For the second week in a row, North Carolina Central University was on the road facing a brand new opponent, Western Michigan University at Waldo Stadium in Kalamazoo. It took the Eagle offense a little bit to get going until a jump start from Torrey Cotton on this 34-yard run. The Eagles chained that into a four-yard rushing TD from Malcolm Bell on the very next play for the first trip to the end zone in 2016 for the Maroon and Gray. The biggest play of the game for North Carolina Central came here in the second quarter. Bell in the pocket, goes deep down the far side. On the bot to Smith, has it to the 40, 30, 20. 15, 10, 5, put him on the board, Levante Smith. That was a 71-yard strike to Levante Smith that helped Bell eclipse 4,000 career yards of passing and 5,000 yards of total offense, and he threw for 209 yards in this game. Smith also had a big game as he amassed 218 yards of total offense with 137 receiving yards, 56 kick return yards, and this 35-yard punt return. Fast forward to the tail end of the first half where NCCU led a punctual one-minute drill started by this reception by Jalen Wilkes and capped by a one-yard strike to David Miller. Just like the Duke game, the Eagle defense continued to swarm the ball as you see Reggie Hunter leading the charge in a tackle for loss. And Antonio Brown notched his first sack of the year. The big defensive story was Josiah Daly, who was everywhere on the gridiron, racking up 17 tackles with 11 solo hits. The final score from Kalamazoo, Western Michigan 70, North Carolina Central 21. The Eagles will open up O'Kelly Reddick Stadium on Saturday, September 17th against St. Augustine's at 6 o'clock. This has been an exclusive presentation of the NCCU Sports Network.